this show had me from the first episode. Ugly Betty is one of the hottest new shows of the season, and our next guest plays Betty's love interest. In the process, he is winning hearts of millions of people. He's has, he has that little innocent shot, mm -hmm. smile, little mm -hmm. shy mm -hmm. attitude. Check it out. To thank you for getting Charlie to go out tonight. All we've done since she got here is sort her in and watch movies in bed. Sounds rough. Um, so just tell her that I'll meet up with her at 7. Okay, bye. <laughs> Please welcome Christopher Gorham. Hey, Chris. Come on, Chris. Hey, Chris. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> Thank you. Welcome. Oh, my God. Shotgun shells. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's tax season, and, oh. and I play an accountant on the show. So these, oh, you're, you're all yes. set. You've got uh, penny rolls and a calculator and legal pads I and actually, everything you need to do taxes. I actually seriously may need that, Chris. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I'm that, that's very set. nice of you. Yeah, I appreciate you're that. You look nothing like your character. Can, do we have a split screen? Yeah. Can we do that split screen? Because you look like a total dork on the show. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. And you're hot. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, uh, you're married. I'm not hitting yeah, on yeah, you. Yeah. I swear to you. <laughs> we'll talk about that in a second. But first, congratulations on the show. Thanks a lot. When Thanks. you went for the audition, did it say nerdy guy? No, you know, um, the guy who created the show, Silvio Orta, yeah. I've worked with before on a show called Jake 2.0 that was on UPN a few years ago. So he just called me and asked me to come in and, and do the part. And uh, he told me it was an accountant. And we just kind of created the look from oh. there. Like the hairstyle was how we used to wear my hair in high school. And, <laughs> yeah. you know, we had to do glasses. And Becky Newton, who plays Amanda on the show, actually chose the glasses because we had two pairs. Well, we had. Uh, uh, well, go ahead. We had a square, square yeah, lenses right. and round lenses, and uh, she said the square lenses made Amanda want to tear them off my face and violate me. So oh. that's uh, that's how we ended up there. See, I, I knew you weren't that innocent. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no. I could just tell. Well, you do look. That's totally different. But I really like this little crush that's going on with Betty. Yeah, it's really great. It's uh, it's a, this great romantic relationship, and it's really different from everything else. Well, it's sweet. It's on TV. Yeah, it's very sweet. It's very innocent. Um, but they don't have that anymore amazing. on television. Not much. Anywhere in Hollywood, really. Not much, yeah. Be careful when you kiss her, though. She's going to staple your lips together. <laughs> no, watch <laughs> out. Races and all that. Yeah. Hey, you had a tough time getting here today, I understand. Yeah. And I apologize for that. Did we do something wrong on our end? I hope not. No, I don't think <laughs> no, so. But I'm sure it's our fault. But we, got, we got pulled <laughs> over. And I, I mean, I've never, I oh, don't think cops? you had traffic laws in New York City. <laughs> <laughs> but apparently you do. And we got pulled over, but not like in LA, you have like car chases. Like sure. the cops oh, yeah. chase you, and yeah. you ride on the freeway, and they throw out tax and things. Love but, that stuff. But um, here, the cop stands out in the middle of the street and just points and pulls people over. And they had like six cars lined up all getting What tickets. were you doing wrong? Uh, I have no idea. I think they were turning right out of the wrong lane or, oh, or something. Oh, yeah. You need to but, pay attention um, to our traffic laws. <laughs> yeah. Sir. Yeah. Were you drunk? Up there? Are you drunk? <laughs> uh, maybe a little bit. <laughs> he doesn't go out and party anymore. He's got kids. He's got a know. wife. How many? Yeah. Do you have two, two now? Two kids. Two boys. Yeah. yeah. Five and three. Lucas and, and Ethan. And the guy's been married seven years. How old are you? you what? Yeah. That's so the first young. question. But I'm 32. Oh, you wow. look 12. Yeah. Really. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mike's like, you look 12. Remember those days? No, I actually don't. It's been so long, I don't even remember anything. Good Thank you, really Julia. <laughs> Tell us about your wife. How'd you guys meet? So we met in school. We both went to UCLA. We were taking a vaudeville class together. <laughs> really? Yeah, hey. we're, it's theater. Well, I don't know, what do you want? We, we were taking a vaudeville class, and we walked into class, and the professor wanted us to pair up. So I immediately picked the prettiest girl Heck in class. Yeah. And uh, we, we stood back to back, and we're supposed to ask each other questions. Yeah. And you ask a question, you respond with a question. So I would ask a question, and, and my now wife would say, what? And I'd ask a question, she'd say, what? And I'm thinking, this poor dim girl doesn't understand <laughs> the exercise. So when we turned around, we had to oh. say a statement. And I thought I'd really shock her. So I turned around, and I said, I think I'm falling in love with you. And she was completely <laughs> thrown. I mean, her face was just like, what? what? And, um, and so that's how we met. Was and it I, really and I, first, I mean, first glance, that kind of thing? Well, I th she was hot, you know. <laughs> <laughs> that's all you care about when and, you're and at the time, anyway, I was just saying something that I thought would, would shock her. Yeah. Um, and we ended up having lunch together later that day, and she told me, she was like, no, jerk. I, like, you're tall. I couldn't hear you. The room was full of people, <laughs> you know? And, um, and I remember sitting down at that first lunch just looking at her and thinking that, that, uh, that we were going to be together. I mean, you know, it was just like, yeah, you're fantastic. But, Chris, that. we have buried the lead on you because yeah. I know he was, he was an intern on Baywatch. Yeah. Oh, come on. In yeah. college then? Yeah, yeah. In the summer of 95, uh, Pamela Anderson was still there. Oh, yeah. And we actually met her at the craft service table. We were both reaching for a banana, which I thought was uh. a little... <laughs> <laughs> All right. I let her have it. I, I, I let her have my banana. 
Did you? Uh, Come on, you... people. Yeah, that's not what he means. He wanted melons. <laughs> so, did you ever try to get on the show as an actor? Then? Well, yeah, I did because I, I was still in school and I really wanted to get sure. my SAG card. So, the week that I was working in casting, um, they a part came up of the swimmer. And so the casting director said, yeah, you know, if you want to come in and read for this part, it was one line. That's every episode. So I was, yeah, yeah. It was like a guy swimming in the ocean and David Hasselhoff, like, would ride up on a jet ski and pick yeah. him up. So I was really excited. I thought, you know, I'm really going to impress him. I'm going to really go all out. So I showed up to work that day in a Speedo <laughs> and, and went to my audition in the Speedo. And was, I was in character of the swimmer and, and, uh, and read my line. How'd that work out for you? And they cast a stuntman. <laughs> And, uh, and I was ridiculed the rest of the summer by everyone in the office <laughs> as being the idiot who showed up in a speedo. So, Mike, that whole speedo plan you had yeah. showing up tomorrow? I have one on now. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to see it, Chris? No. Yes, sure. Okay. Chris, thanks so much. Hey, by the way, we have some little Oh, Benny's got the t-shirts for you. Oh, yeah. Your kids? Yeah. They like they love New York, right? New York. Yeah, look this at this. I love New York t-shirts. We really went all out for you there. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> the show has a budget. <laughs> oh, this, is, this is amazing. Thank yeah. you. Say hi to them, Corey. Say hi to your yeah, wife. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. great meeting you. Nice Thank you. you. Well, good luck with Ugly Betty, man. Yes. It's so good. Airs Thursday nights. You all know that. Everybody's watching it. It's on ABC. Don't go away. More of the morning show. <laughs> great job. Keep smart.